this first collection of pots that we're getting is just an introduction or just like the first chapter, I think, reviving our culture, bringing it back and restoring it for us and keeping it alive in our hands and in our traditions. So bringing that back will actually help us to like um, preserve what we have left. The Coming Home Project is a collaboration between the Pueblo of Milwaukee's Mapo Arts Center and the um, Smithsonian Institution's National Museum of the American Indian to bring collections to their source communities, gaining a new life. And they're basically able to speak and teach to the communities they came from, you know, basically a century after they left. So we were working with them on trying to bring back a selection, a highlighted selection of the various villages that are around here, various Tewa tribes here. Good to have these back where, where they originated from. That's important for the people. It really can help remind people of the, the skill and talent and artistry of their ancestors. Hopefully um, inspire people to continue that work that their ancestors did long ago. To not let these cultural practices like pottery making, you know, just fall by the wayside or become very dormant, but that they'll always have an active presence in the communities, you know, today and in the future. To actually see the pieces and have them here is really important, I think, for all of us. And I'm really glad that they are doing this and inviting the communities to come and take a look. It's about bringing these pots back that have been um, gone for a long time. You know, we need them back to, to study them and, um, you know, touch them, you know, and uh, look at, you know, their, of course, their designs and stuff and then incorporate that back into what we're doing today. The opportunities that we have regarding these pots is enormous because a lot of our younger youth have yet to experience how to make these pots. It's important that we teach them to put their hands on, do the old methods, the coil methods, and letting them know that it's not just a piece of clay. It's not material. It's what you put into it from your heart and your mind. It's that song, it's the prayer, it's the conversations that took place when they were being made. As those traditions were lost, what we're trying to do here at the PO is, is bring those traditions back because they help heal us. And so hopefully as we bring back these traditions, bring back these reminders, they'll uh, enable Native people, enable communities to be healthier, to be happier, um, to solve a lot of the problems that we have going on today. It's important that we, uh, we do it in the right way because at the PO, it, it's all about trying to do things the right way. I mean, even the word PO is the path. And so we want to do things in the right way. It's bringing the ancestors home. It's very spiritual for me because they're my great grandparents, my great aunties, my great uncles that are being brought back. It's very important because it's, it's our culture, it's our spirit, it's our wholeness and it's our heart.